should write. This is your first business. Go on writing. This instruction was given to His Holiness Giriraj Swami personally by His Divine Grace Srila Prabhupada in 1971 and repeated over the years. In more than five decades since, Giriraj Swami has served Srila Prabhupada faithfully and tirelessly, sharing his experiences and realizations with us in his books. Have you ever wondered how service to God relates to service to man? What was Srila Prabhupada's vision that led people around the world to chant Krishna's names? Hare Krishna 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 Hare 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 Watering the seed is an invaluable offering to all aspirants on the path of devotion with many wonderful personal exchanges between Srila Prabhupada and his dear disciple. Giriraj Swami kindly shares his realizations with the honesty, wisdom, and humility for which he is known and loved. It transports us into Srila Prabhupada's intimate association during some of the most historic moments of ISKCON's development. Like in the sky, there is one moon only, and there are millions of stars. But one more, oh, despite the whole darkness of the night. Similarly, at least those who are taken to Krishna consciousness, you become, each of you become a moon and enlighten the world. Oh, hey, Vaishnava Guru, Yara Saguru, The great souls described in these pages are bright, full moons of Srila Prabhupada's mercy. Their lives are living instructions. Their activities, chandrikas, cooling, illuminating moonbeams of Vaishnav sharing, teaching, and realization. With their unconditional love and dedication to Srila Prabhupada, these personalities built this worldwide movement and gifted it to us, to be nurtured by it, and to serve.
exclusive treatise on one's last days of life. that gives readers the resource to face death squarely. And deal successfully with that often fearful and painful, but also saving moment. Down to earth and practical as well as scriptural, both fresh and mature, it draws us in with superb narrative and also answers tough questions about death and dying. Drawing from both spiritual leaders and experts in the field of hospice and palliative medicine, life's final exam has universal application. One of the most important books about Srila Prabhupada. It's about Srila Prabhupada and his Leela of years of heartbreak and struggle in Juhu, Mumbai. No one else can write this book like His Holiness Giriraj Swami Maharaj. Srila Prabhupada struggled to establish Hare Krishna land and build a temple for Sri Sri Radha Rasabihari in Juhu on the outskirts of Bombay was perhaps the greatest effort of his preaching movement. By the strength of his desire, an overgrown plot of land in what had been a remote fishing village, infested with rats, snakes and mosquitoes, became a place of pilgrimage and devotional service. And after a prolonged and arduous but victorious struggle, when the conveyance was finally signed, he declared, It was a good fight. Someone should write a book about it. I'll build you a temple transports us into one of the great events of our time. It is a story of surrender on the path of pure love, an incomparable story that many have tried to relate, but which no one will ever be able to tell, like His Holiness Kiriraj Swami. From the beginning, Kiriraj Swami served the Juhu project in various roles for 30 years and spent years researching, writing, and preparing the book for publication. It is part of ISKCON history, a complement to Srila Prabhupada's Leelamrita. This book is a page turner a page turner to the highest degree. Once you begin, you just can't put it down. Kiriraj Swami has written his fifth book, Dancing White Elephants. Traveling with Srila Prabhupada in India, August 1970 to March 1972, covering visits to Amritsar, Indore, Surat, Bombay, Calcutta, Allahabad, Gorakhpur, Delhi, Madras, and Mayapur. In some 400 pages of text and 17 images, Dancing White Elephants, with the foreword by Malati Dasi, who was present for most of the adventures, will captivate the minds and hearts of readers and increase their attachment to and love for Srila Prabhupada and his white elephants, his disciples who helped him in his mission. Through Maharaja's carefully chosen words, you will see the exquisite sights, 
and feel like you are living the experiences that were part of establishing the Hare Krishna movement in India. You will meet incredible devotees who became pillars of this movement through their own storied spiritual growth and advancement and be introduced to seemingly ordinary persons whose lives became transformed by contact with Prabhupada and his dancing white elephants, just as he envisioned. Bande Hang Sri Guru Sri Juta